Vincenzo's Gold Crypto Investing. This is a VGCI News and uh, Weather Authority breaking news update. I gave you that winter forecast on here, a preliminary winter forecast, and we're going to put out an update on your October forecast so we can try to hone in and see if we're on the right track for winter or if we're off and need to audible, right? But we have a big major problem and it, it could be a life and death situation. As you can go check out Bloomberg News, this isn't me making things up, Bloomberg.com. You can go to NPR Global Natural Gas Prices are uh, soaring because they're skyrocketing. They're at a, they've only been higher than this two times in the last nearly uh, decade and a half. European energy crisis is about to go global as, go, as gas price soars. What a modern energy crisis looks like and why no country is safe. Even the Communist News Network, Europe is paying record prices for energy. A winter crisis looms. Financial Times, how the negative natural gas crisis uh, emulates the Northern Rock, right? It's going to be a disaster because when you shut world economies down and now uh, you're pushing everybody away from uh, petroleum and oil as an alternative and the the best most efficient, cheapest way to give the masses affordable energy uh, for the mass population. You're restricting that and shutting that down and making it uh, making it illegal essentially to use that. And you're switching everybody to solar and to uh, natural gas as a clean alternative. Well, you shut the world's economy down. Uh, you're putting massive regulations on uh, where and how much natural gas you can get. And now you're forcing everybody onto it. There's not the infrastructure for it, right? This price has been suppressed for years, decades, because they've wanted more and more people to use this because it's cleaner, but they knew people wouldn't pay a, 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 a very high price for it. Like back in the 2000s when they started, or late in the 90s and early 2000s, they started forcing everybody to natural gas. But look at the price. It was $15, $16 per, however they measure this, Right. And the prices were too high, so nobody would take it. So then they massively suppressed the price by 99%. So for the last 10 to 15 years, when everyone's been switched now to natural gas, it's been very cheap. But now with this hyper, this massive inflation we're having worldwide and in the United States and Europe, and this is only going to get worse because we're printing ourselves into a great, a, uh, we're printing ourselves into a inflationary depression, right? Stagflation. You can't print your way out of things. You can't print, you can print a bunch of money, but you can't print natural gas that people need to live. You can't print food that people need to live. You can't print homes that people need to live in, right? You can't print uh, consumer goods and necessities that people need to live. So you start getting product shortages, like now natural gas shortages and skyrocketing prices. And this has no reason to stop, right? If you get a cold winter, this thing could be way up here. You know what I mean? This right here already is a disaster because the last 10 winters, we've been uh, two, 250% lower. So your prices are already going to be 20, 25, 30, 40, maybe 50% higher. Some places 100% higher when they have massive draconian regulations, right, on energy. You might be 100% higher and you're going to have shortages. People that want natural gas because they're freezing to death in their own homes, there's just no natural gas for them to have and they freeze to death. Or there is some left, but the price is so high, they can't afford to to heat their house sufficiently and they still freeze to death in their house, right? Even though they had the ability to get gas, they just couldn't afford it. It's a disaster and this is all the communist, socialist uh, policies that you get. Uh, this is what you get. And if we get a cold winter in North America and specifically Central and Eastern United States, we're going to have a disaster. Like the state of Michigan, where I'm at, we've had Gretchen Whitmore shut down the pipeline that was needed for heating oil. In the UP, a lot of people still use heating oil and propane, right? And uh, wood burning stoves that they tried to make illegal up there. They're not, they almost ran out in the winter of 14. And in the Gretchen Whitmore's first winter, we had a big uh, January cold snap, record breaking. And uh, we almost ran out of heating oil. And she sent out emergency orders that we had to lower our heat. Yeah, that's right. You heard me right. We had five consecutive nights of sub zero temperatures in the greater Detroit metropolitan area, sub 15 to 30 below in the northern and UP, right? And high temperatures, sub zero and single digits for a week. And she told us to lower our heat to 62 degrees. 
Uh, that's how you get your pipes bursting and hypothermia in a house. And she wanted us to lower our heat to 62 degrees when we were 15 to 25 degrees below zero. Not windshield, actual temperature because of her draconian laws and this communist uh, green energy movement that we got going on. It's a disaster. And I'm warning you right now, you better get on board to Vincenzo's Go Crypto Invest, VGCI uh, News and Weather Authority that sponsors Michigan Snow Forecast Gold Standards. You better... Uh, uh, hit that follow button right there. Just hit that beautiful follow button and you'll get all my alerts. You'll get up to the date uh, forecast that I'm going to have by the midweek before uh, September ends out. We're going to have an October forecast uh, on temperature is a brief snippet. I think it's going to be mild in the upper Midwest and Great Lakes. We might start to cool off as we move our way into the eastern U.S. towards Halloween. And the Pacific Northwest, I think it's going to be stormy and a little bit chilly with mountain snow starting, right? I'm going to get an October forecast out. It's going to be a brutal winter. You need to get on board the Michigan Snow Forecast Gold Standard as we have a big natural gas crisis uh, coming for the winter time, especially if it's a cold winter. It's going to be a disaster, right? Stay up to the date with Vincenzo's Gold Crypto Investing. Peace and love.